So I've been gone for a while, and I thought I should explain why I've been gone for this long. It's nothing that happened traumatic or anything. It's kind of just I'm not exactly sure where I want to go with this channel. I like traveling and I like that whole aspect of it, but traveling is just it costs way too much in the world we live in nowadays. I need to find some way to just create constant, consistent videos. And along with that, I've had a lot of other really good things going on in life. My brother and I started a podcast, which is doing very, very well on TikTok. We have a video at about, I think it's at 6.5 million views now. We have like 12,000 followers on that page. So that's pretty impressive and I'm very happy about that. And if you guys haven't yet, go check it out. I'll leave it in the link down in the description. It's called the Youngblood Squared Podcast. So yeah, go check that out. And then the other thing that's been going on that has been taking up a lot of my time is that my little brother and I, Josh, you've met him, started a social media marketing agency called Youngblood Media. And that has been going pretty well as well. Yeah, so we started a business, we started a podcast, and both of those are going great. But now I wanna figure out how to get my channel to do well, like my personal channel, because I've always wanted to like have my name out there and be like a YouTuber, but I'm still trying to figure out exactly what that means to me. And this is a video of me being completely real. I still am not sure on my thoughts. I'm still trying to figure it out. And honestly, if you guys have any suggestions for what kind of videos I should make and how to make them, just leave it in the comments down below. I could definitely use the help. I want to keep the same travel concept, but the whole reason that I named the channel Jack Youngblood is because it's just my name, which means anything pertaining to me can go on the channel. It doesn't have to be boxed into travel or food or whatever. It, it can just be anything that involves me. And that's the whole simple part about it. But I'm trying to figure out what kind of videos I want to produce because I've also started getting tired of being the one holding the camera in a vlog style because I believe that the vlog style is kind of gone. Honestly, it's not the type of videos I wanna create. I would rather have a cameraman, but I don't have the funds to hire one right now. Well, I guess I could, but also finding the person that would wanna do that. And I want it to be like a friend or something. Like it, I don't want it to be some professional or whatever. I want it to be someone who can go on trips with me, hang out with my friends, and just, you know, have fun with it. Just like how like Balin Levine, his filmer is like one of his best friends. Then there's a ton of other YouTubers that do the exact same thing. All their cameramen are their friends that don't mind being behind the camera. I've been already thinking of that, of how I would manage that fairly so that they get paid and I get paid. Now all it is is finding the person to do that. With everything going on with the podcast and the business, I've honestly been thinking that I probably wouldn't be able to post every single week, probably every single two weeks. Consistency is a key, which I've definitely been lacking the past couple weeks. We also had our family dog pass away, so that was a little bit of a rough patch. But yeah, with everything going on in my life, uh, I've been very, very busy. I don't know if I would be able to produce videos weekly, especially since I'm editing my own videos, and I love editing my own videos. I love producing videos that I can be like, yeah, I made that, like, I made that, I approve that, I uploaded it. I just like the feeling of, like, doing it myself. I have a vision of the somewhat the type of videos I want to put out, kind of like without pranking, you know, Balin Levine, that type of thing. Like a daily vlog, not really, just showing, like, moments of my life when I'm hanging out with friends or traveling or whatever, but not in my own hand. Or maybe sometimes, it was fun when I wanted my road trip, but that was when I was alone. When I'm with people, it's just awkward to pull out the camera and film yourself. You don't get the real moments. People start acting like they have to be someone they're not in front of the camera. And that's nobody's fault, honestly. It's just that once someone puts a lens in front of your face and if you're not used to that, it's just natural that someone's not gonna say or do exactly what they would do without the camera there. I'm very blessed to be where I am in life right now. I uh, didn't expect the podcast to do so well. And honestly, I've been having a lot of fun doing that. The only thing I feel like I'm missing now is my main YouTube channel. Cause I wanna make money on YouTube and I wanna be a YouTuber and I wanna inspire others. That's kind of what I wanna do for a while. So I'm hoping that maybe this video, I can clip it in like a year or two and I'll be like, oh my God, I can't believe I was at that point in life. Then be looking back at it and be like, I'm glad I went through that. 
and had to think through that to get to where I am. Our podcast channel on TikTok is doing really well and it's actually monetized now. The problem is that TikTok doesn't make much money and I think everyone knows that. YouTube is where the real money is at, even though I don't care that much about the money. It is nice to say that you're making money on YouTube because that I feel like that's such a huge milestone. But yeah, pretty much I'm just making this video to tell you guys where I'm at and why I haven't uploaded in a while. And the videos will be coming soon once I figure things out. In the meantime, you guys will see me on my podcast channel. If any of you are watching this and you for some reason want to get into a career of filmmaking, or not filmmaking, but being a cameraman, um, and being paid, obviously, uh, let me know. Shoot me a DM on Instagram, which I'll leave the link for that down below as well. But yeah, I think that's pretty much all I wanted to go over. I've been having a lot of fun making YouTube videos, but now I just want to figure out a different way to make videos while also balancing all of my other stuff that I have going on in life. I appreciate you guys watching this video. Make sure to like and subscribe as usual. And yeah, I'll see you guys when I make my next video. Also, merch is coming soon. The next time that I drop a video, the merch will be out. And I like the new line of merch. It's, uh, it's a good one. So, all right, see you guys.